circled on a map and that area is a specific hygiene area so there's okay. one of these at each end of it so we've got this one here and then further in there's another one in that section and why is this not ideal oh just its location it's a bit tricky just here so that's what a we've shower got some is steps there? coming in here which we'll take care of specific hygiene area so that's your zone control zone yeah 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 but this this works well for what we're doing yeah. it works really well i guess you've got to you've got to do the best you can in each situation sometimes yeah. we have to move location off the map and we have to talk about that with engineers and, and doc and yeah. discuss a better location to have this set up this is working fine for what we're doing here so good. normally we would come in here we'll open up the bin we will take our boots off put one in the bin and scrub it and we want to keep all of our dirt inside this bin so this is some dirt that the boys have been scrubbing off these boots will be fairly clean we've got something we can pick them off with in here the aim is to keep the mud in this bin At the end of the day, those bins, that mud gets taken out and uh, At the finish of the job. Finish yep, of the job. The bins oh, come yeah. out. Everything inside the bins gets disposed of if they're, if they're absolutely, you know, really, really full of mud. Um, the whole bin will get disposed of. We like to recycle as much as we can. Sure. So um, we, can, we can clean everything out and steam clean it, steerage in it again, keep it disinfected. If you're doing a real muddy job, which this job could turn muddy if we keep having lots of rain, uh, the boys have got extra boots. So we would wear a pair of boots into the job, like as, as we're doing now, turning up on the job, and then uh, leave the boots in the bin, put another pair on and take them in, and they would be the boots that we wear all day. And when we're finished with that, we have finished our day's work, Put the dirty boots in the other bin, put your clean boots on and drive on out, head home, wherever you're heading. We just work with it, I mean, it doesn't really take that long at the end of the day. But um, our job revolves around the carry tree so we really need to be seen to be doing the right thing around the carry tree. It starts back at our yard where we do all our processing oh. and they, they get it there, they understand it there. You can't just yeah. come in out of the car park and walk into the building, you've got a cleaning process to do there as well. Oh, that's great, so they get that sort of introduction to yep. the um, principles yep. from the moment that they really step foot into the, yep. into the business. Yeah, it's all explained to them and it's always taught. And having, having the two boots set up is way quicker yep. and way easier, you just come in, swap boots, off you go. Everything is sterilised and inspected before we come in. We have, to, we have to clean all of our own gear, we steam clean everything, we, we get together every item of tooling that we need to bring in here. You know, from post hole borers to shovels, your hand tools, everything. Even your tool belts, everything that comes in here is steam cleaned to 120 degrees. And then it's um, dried out and it's sterigened. Then uh, we put it on our trailer we go around to the dock office or the, or the dock representative will come and see us and um, they'll take note of everything we've got in there, check everything, make sure it's clean and um, then we can bring it in. And we either bring it in by hand or by helicopter depending on how sure. far stuff's going. Oh, so it's a really good end-to-end yep. -end process. We notice that in the storage area everything is above the ground. Yep, try well, and keep it as yeah. sterile as possible. Once it lands in here our bags are just generally cut open and shoveled out, emptied out onto the track and then the bags are all put together in one big bag and taken out, out and disposed of again. Oh, that's yep. yeah. And then, yeah, there's a lot more processing in there, okay. um, sterilising of tools and stuff in there, like especially okay. while we're building the boardwalk and things like that.